There's a deer right in the road. Hey folks, Fast Freddy D coming at you. It's been an eventful weekend. Um, last night I tried to go into the, what would be the west side of the St. Regis Canoe area. Last time we were in the east side, we went in through St. Regis Pond. This time I'm going through Hole Pond and I'm back into Long Pond. Um, things were a little hectic last night. I ran into a big rainstorm on my way up here. I tried to get up here after work and um, got up here and it was pouring down rain. The wind was blowing so hard I didn't even really want to try and get across Hole Pond. So I headed about 40 minutes down to my camp and um, spent the night there. Well, this morning I got up and went up to Hole Pond again, and the wind was still blowing, so I didn't get my camera out, I didn't film any of that, but I got all the way back in there and I got myself a sight on Long Pond, and lo and behold, I forgot my one pair of pants, my steak with all my cold food in it, and worst of all, the rum. I forgot the frickin' rum. How can you forget? I don't want to talk about it, but anyways. This afternoon, I paddled out and I've just drove back to camp because, well, you gotta have priorities. So, we're on our way back. And the good thing about this is now the weather's a lot better, sunshiny, and we should be able to do a nice, do some filming on our way in. I'm gonna do some fishing and just take, kind of take my time getting back to camp. Hey, how's it going? We're halfway past Hole Pond now. Um, just found a little place where there's a much wind. You probably can't hear this. Probably blowing this camera right up. Can't mic on this. But I'm not gonna take a lot of footage on this pond because I just want to get off it. This is not. This is a privately owned pond. This is in a state land. Um, we'll get back at you in a few minutes. I just wanted to give you a look around. And it's beautiful even here. A couple minutes that's where we're going that's the railroad tracks that's where we got across so This is the whole pond to Turtle Pond Crossing. All you really gotta do is just come up over this little hill right here, cross the tracks and back down. So far it's been a nice paddle. A little bit of wind on the first pond. Let's see how these next ponds are. I'm gonna get some fishing in across these. Hopefully we can show you a couple fish. Turtle Pond. Well, this is where I sit. Yep. This is the end of Turtle Pond. And I can't remember the name of this little pond we're coming into. I'll put a little caption in there if I can remember to do it. If you come in here, plan on a little bit of little little canoe drag. That's a major. It's only from here down to right there where that water's rippling.
This is the canoe carry for Long Pond. This is gonna be my last carry of the day. Nice little entrance for it. Well, this is my homestead, site five. I don't know if you can see my tent up in there. I'm already set up. Got me a nice little beach to come up on. This is Long Pond, beautiful view. I don't know if you can see the mountains over there. It came into focus, I'm not sure. This is a heck of a way to kick off night one on Long Pond. Got a couple of fish today. Got to do a lot of paddling. Forgot my rum, but I recovered. Some things are worth going back for. Now you heard that right. I left the cooler in the truck with all my rum, all my mixer, and my steak in it. And I had to go all the way back. Didn't notice it until I got to the campsite. I'll be done.
Well, put the fire up a little bit, sit here, have a couple more drinks, I think. And then relax. It's been a long day. Talk to you folks again when I get in the tent. Hey folks, more than one uh, St. Rudy's canoe area. We're on the west side of it this um, weekend. Um, last time we were on the east side over on uh, St. Rudy's Pond itself. This side of the pond, this side of the park is just as big as that, if not even a little bit bigger, if you ask me. Um, we're on site five on Long Pond. It's a pretty nice site. Um, I'm going to give you a walk around here in a little bit. My um, goal is to put a little montage together of um, as many of the sites as I can here so people can get an idea of what they're looking for before they come here. If that helps anybody. If you like that idea, leave a couple comments and I'll um, try to work a little bit harder on getting these done. I've got quite a few of these. Uh, today's plan is we're going to do some exploring, maybe a little fishing. I don't know. We'll see how it is. It's a nice little wind for drift fishing, so maybe we can get into that. I'm going to keep heading west. Probably about a three mile paddle back in here. You know, I didn't exactly go straight, so it might be four. Um, beautiful paddle though. All easy portages. Um, you'll see in the video on the walk in here that the train bridge one was probably the hardest one. Uh, the long pond one was, eh, that was a little, wasn't that long, so it didn't really make it that hard. It's flat. You'll see that too in the video. I'm going to try to walk each one of the portages in here too if I can, or as many as I can. 
That way people get an idea of what they're getting themselves into before they come in here. But it's a beautiful place. And no matter what it takes, you should try to get in here. All right, folks, I'll get it with you later on. Have a good Site five. My site. Not a bad beach. Ever been swimming there? That's not a bad swim. It's mostly gravel. Big fire pit. Already plenty of logs to sit on. Big wide open site. Half of it's closed for reclamation. Privies up the hill. All the yellow signs and the red markers. Red tape in the trees. Big spot, put your tent there. Another spot for a tent there. Probably put another one there. Maybe another one here. Right there, definitely. This is a nice site. Nice view right out here on the point. Been getting a nice breeze. With the sites I've looked at today, this is one of the better ones. Oh. Here's your look at that. Ping pond. Fifth pond for the weekend. It's probably the last one as far as I'm gonna go in. Today was supposed to be a rest day, but I decided to come over here. Beautiful in here. Can't describe you. I don't know if this camera's showing how nice it is in here, but it is gorgeous. It is gorgeous. That's the outlet I just came up. This pond is pretty much level with Long Pond. That's an easy little quick paddle up in there. I got video of that. You're going to love it. All right. I'm going to take a lap paddle around here. I think there's a campsite on here. If there is. We'll do a little review of that one too while we're here. All right.
Hey folks, well that's a wrap for the weekend. I'm almost home. Um, hope you enjoyed my little trip up to the St. Regis Canoe area on the Long Pond end. Uh, next time hopefully we can do the whole loop and I can show you the portage out of there on the, the short end of that and some of the campground over by Fish Creek and stuff like that. Well, hit those like and subscribe buttons and I'll see you next time.